And so the take home here is means tests do not necessarily convey cause effect because here are real participants following the study and those participants did not conform to the means. The means were a collection of the individual responses in an average. And so it can be misleading to people to say with confidence that their response will track with the means. They will likely have an individual response. And so some may confer that, well, we need, this is the reason why we need to do very low carbohydrate diet because look, the average was less, there's less decreases in resting metabolic rate, or in this case, sorry, total energy expenditure with this diet. There's some that had lower, had significant, you know, more than almost a thousand. This person had almost a, a thousand decrease in their total energy expenditure. And so that's just a take home, just it, individual differences don't necessarily agree with the means. And so when you see a randomized control trial, remember that there could be individual differences. Some people may vary and stray from the means that were reported. And so it's not necessarily cause effect.